Hello everyone, this is one of the uh, shorter par fours. So typically I will use a three wood off the tee and go straight for the green. However, we are heading into a wind, so we might not make it. Um, let's have a look at the reverse angle. We've got a lot of green to play with, but going over there would leave us with a long putt. And uh, that kind of defeats the object. Then we may as well just lay up short and then play a wedge to be close. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to be taking some of the spin off the ball. We don't want it to um, have too much backspin. Just missed the ding slightly. And uh, cleared the trees and probably going to land in the bunker. Just, just in the bunker. As you can see, I almost, almost made that shot. Um, it would have been nice if it did make it because it probably would have been very close to the flag. Right, my opponent's turn. Let's see if he takes the same risk. Looks like he's teeing up with three wood. If we see his profile shift to the left, then that will mean that he's going for the green. Doesn't look like it too much. I think he is going to lay up in the fairway. Yes, he is. Taking the safe approach to the game. Or to the hole, I should say. And he's still landed in the rough. A lot of fairway to aim for, so I'm not sure why he landed in the rough. Right, I paused the video because he was taking his time and uh, he hasn't hit it very close to the hole so he's probably still got a two putt from there. Alright, it's me again and uh, I'll be hitting a 60 degree or 60 yard wedge out of here. Uh, we don't have a lot of green to play with so this is a very difficult shot. Chances are it's going to roll past the hole um, and give it about... 45% power. Oh, hit the flag. That would have taken some distance off the ball. So that was quite uh, fortunate for me because that ball was definitely going to land past the flag. The problem is that if you if you use too, too little power, then it's not going to clear the um, edge of the bunker and it's going to roll back into the bunker. So you've really got to hit it out of the bunker with the risk of going past the hole. Right, that's a very good attempt. He almost got it in the hole. Alright, my turn. This putt is breaking ever so slightly from the left and from the right, as you can see right in front of the ball. Actually, I'm just going to aim dead straight for the hole because it seems to be breaking both ways. Right on the ding, and that's in. All right, easy win for me. Even though I took a risk at the beginning and was in the bunker, I still managed to score a birdie. Uh, proof that sometimes risks can pay off. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. If you did, please give my video a like, and please subscribe to my channel for more. Thank you very much.